Investigators say two young women from Simpsonville were killed in a hit and run crash in downtown Charleston. One of the victims was just weeks away from graduating from the College of Charleston. The coroner says Lizzie Zito and Ariana Gamber died at the scene. They were both just 20 years old and graduates of Woodmont High School in Greenville County. Charleston police say the crash happened Sunday morning near the downtown area. Roads were closed for nearly 12 hours before reopening. Officers say they found debris in the roadway, which led them to start investigating the crash as a hit and run. Lizzie's uncle says he wants to know how this happened and for the person responsible to face consequences. They really shouldn't even be saying killed. As far as I'm concerned, they were murdered because they were hit and they were left there to die. If the person who hit them just stayed at the scene and called the ambulance, perhaps it could have been saved, but he didn't do that, okay? This monster left them there to die. We're going through a type of hell no family should go through. No parents should be burying their kids. Now, the police department says the investigation is active and progressing, but so far, no arrests have been made. Lizzie was a senior studying psychology at the College of Charleston. The school released a statement saying in part, quote, Lizzie was set to graduate this May, impressively completing her degree in three years. We ask that you please keep Lizzie's family and friends in your thoughts during this most difficult of times.